This study investigates the cross-vendor reproducibility of radio mics-based machine learning models for computer-aided diagnosis in prostate cancer detection. Two models, Support Vector Machines, SVM, and Random Forest, RF, were trained on radiomic features extracted from T2-weighted MRI images using Pyradiomics and MR Cradiomics libraries. Feature selection was performed with the Maximum Relevance Minimum Redundancy, MRMR, technique to optimize feature fusion. The SVM model, combining features from both libraries, achieved an area under the curve, AUC, of 0.74 on the multi-improd dataset, Siemens scanner. However, its performance decreased to 0.60 on the Philips test set. In contrast, the RF model demonstrated robustness, particularly when using pyradiomics features alone, achieving an AUC of 0.78 on Philips. These findings suggest that multimodal feature integration can improve the robustness and generalizability of machine learning models for clinical decision support in prostate cancer detection. The study's results highlight the potential of integrating radiomic features from different libraries to develop reliable AI-driven diagnostic tools that maintain efficacy across various imaging platforms. This research marks a significant step towards enhancing clinical decision support through multimodal learning and feature fusion, ultimately improving prostate cancer diagnosis. Magnetic resonance imaging, MRI, is revolutionizing medical imaging, particularly in the diagnosis and treatment of prostate cancer, the most common cancer among men in Western countries and the second leading cause of death. Despite its cost-effectiveness, MRI's widespread adoption is hindered by lengthy acquisition times, high costs, and variability between centers and readers. Recent advances in radiomic feature extraction and artificial intelligence, AI, have improved prostate cancer diagnosis but the reproducibility of these AI models remains a significant concern. Reproducibility is crucial in ensuring the trustworthiness, effectiveness, and clinical acceptance of machine learning, ML, applications, particularly in medical imaging where variations in MISTER imaging devices and sequence acquisition settings can hinder the application and adoption of ML techniques to new environments. To address this concern, Developing and validating a more cost-effective prostate MRI protocol for improved prostate cancer risk stratification could decrease the financial burden of implementing MRI for widespread clinical use. Accurate results in training AI models for medical imaging require careful consideration of precision in detection, and prostate cancer MRI has encountered reproducibility challenges especially when ML models are implemented across different MRI ecosystems built by various vendors. A pressing need exists for uniform datasets and thorough cross-vendor validation studies to enhance model reproducibility and universality. A unique biparametric prostate MRI, IMPRODBPMRI, has demonstrated potential in reducing unnecessary biopsy procedures while improving detection of clinically significant prostate cancer, providing an easily implementable MISTER sequence with reasonable acquisition time. This study examines the cross-vendor reproducibility of radio mics-based machine learning models for computer-aided diagnosis of prostate cancer, focusing on the determination of tumor aggressiveness from magnetic resonance imaging MRI, scans. By utilizing the same MRI sequence across different devices, vendors, and imaging sites, the research aims to improve the reproducibility and accuracy of machine learning models. The study employs a meticulous process of feature selection and a comprehensive package of evaluation metrics to assess the performance of two conventional machine learning models in unseen datasets. The models are evaluated using two open-source radiomic feature extraction toolkits, MR Cradiomics and Pyradiomics, with T2-weighted MRI images, which are conventionally used in prostate cancer imaging and have clinically acceptable acquisition times. The MRI data collection involves imaging data from 637 men with a clinical suspicion of prostate cancer, enrolled in prospective, registered, and completed clinical trials. The pooled study sample includes axial T2-weighted images, acquired using the same MISTER device, Siemens MAGNETOM Vario 3T, as well as a portion of one dataset scanned with an MRI device from a different vendor, Philips Ingenia 3T. This approach enables the evaluation of model performance in situations where only a part of the imaging protocol is obtained, 
facilitating their incorporation into clinical workflows. By exploring the reproducibility of machine learning models across different devices and vendors, this study aims to accelerate the clinical acceptance of AI-powered diagnostics, ensuring precision and dependability in patient care. Prostate cancer aggressiveness grading using image data post-processing involves the use of Gleason grade groups based on biopsy samples. Radiomic feature extraction, performed using pyradiomics and MR cradiomics packages, yields 2693 radiomic feature values. The data is split into training, validation, and unseen test datasets, with proportions of 54.6%, 13.6%, and 31.8%, respectively. Feature selection is conducted using the maximum relevance minimum redundancy algorithm to eliminate redundancy and identify features with high predictive power. This process selects the top 40 features, which are then subjected to univariate analysis on the training and validation datasets. The 14 most predictive variables are selected, exhibiting individual significance and a synergistic effect in increasing model precision. The selection process is applied separately to the MR cradiomics and pyradiomics packages, as well as jointly, resulting in three sets of selected radiomic features for evaluation. Predictive machine learning models are developed using these selected features. A cohort of 637 participants is divided into three groups, 434 for training and internal checks, and 203 for external tests with 180 participants scanned with the same vendor and 23 scanned with a different vendor. Two conventional machine learning techniques are evaluated, support vector machine and random forest models. For the SVM model, missing data is imputed using median imputation, and values are adjusted carefully. The selection of 14 features ensures that the selected features effectively express the biological characteristics linked to a diagnosis of prostate cancer. The use of the MRMR algorithm and the selection of 14 features enables the development of robust and reliable machine learning models for prostate cancer aggressiveness prediction. The reproducibility of radio mics based machine learning models across different vendors is crucial for the reliability of computer aided diagnosis systems. To investigate this, two machine learning techniques were employed support vector machines and random forest. The latter was chosen for its robustness in handling numerous features, a requirement for the support vector machine to perform well. Both techniques utilized the same data splits and feature selection protocol for training. The selected features for pyradiomics, MR cradiomics, and their combination, referred to as pyradiomics plus MR cradiomics, are presented in tables 1, 2, and 3, respectively. When applying the support vector machine model to the combined features, an area under the receiver operating characteristic curve of 0.74 was achieved on the multi improd dataset using the same scanner. However, the performance on the Phillips test set yielded a lower area under the curve of 0.35, indicating the influence of different scanners on model accuracy. The random forest model exhibited similar results, with an area under the curve of 0.73 on the multi improd set and an area under the curve of 0.60 on the Phillips test set. The results of the support vector machine and random forest models trained over pyradiomics and MR cradiomics are presented in figures 1 and 2, respectively. Notably, further analysis of models trained exclusively on pyradiomics or MR cradiomics features for reproducibility on Phillips data revealed significant differences. The findings suggest that the scanner used has a significant impact on the accuracy of radio mics based machine learning models, highlighting the need for cross vendor reproducibility in radio mics based computer aided diagnosis systems. This underscores the importance of developing models that can adapt to different scanner vendors to ensure reliable diagnostic outcomes. The authors present the results of training machine learning models on pyradiomics-derived features and MRC radiomics features for predicting aggressiveness in prostate cancer. Utilizing pyradiomics features alone, the random forest model achieved a robust area under the curve, AUC, of 0.68 with a 90% confidence interval, C, of 0.61, 0.74, on the multi-improd test set and an AUC of 0.78 with a 90% C of 0.61, 0.94 on the Phillips test set. 
This highlights the significant predictive capability of pyradiomics-derived features. The support vector machine, SVM, model trained on pyradiomics features alone yielded an AUC of 0.77 with a 90% C of 0.59, 0.92 on the Philips test set, but performed poorly on the multi improd test set with an AUC of 0.60 with a 90% C of 0.53, 0.66. In contrast, utilizing only MRC radiomics features resulted in varied outcomes across models. The random forest model achieved an AUC of 0.56 with a 90% C of 0.40, 0.73 on the Philips set and an AUC of 0.68 with a 90% C of 0.63, 0.74 on the multi-improd test set. The SVM model demonstrated an AUC of 0.53 with a 90% C of 0.36, 0.71 on the Philips set and an AUC of 0.73 with a 90% C of 0.67, 0.78 on the multi-improd test set. The study employed an extensive range of hyperparameters for random forest and SVM algorithms to optimize performance. Leveraging advanced radiomics features derived from pyradiomics and MRC radiomics packages. The analysis of radiomics based machine learning models for computer aided diagnostics, CAD, reveals that combining features from both pyradiomics and MRC radiomics significantly enhances predictive performance. Two models were evaluated a random forest model and a support vector machine, SVM, model. Both underwent methodical tuning processes, focusing on optimizing the ROC AUC metric. The SVM model achieved a high AUC score of 0.74 on the multi improd dataset when utilizing combined features from pyradiomics and MR radiomics. However, its performance dropped significantly on the Philips test set, with an AUC of 0.60, indicating susceptibility to variations introduced by different scanners. In contrast, the random forest model showed a similar trend with an AUC of 0.73 on the multi-improd set and 0.60 on the Philips test set. The key advantage of the random forest lies in its aggregation of predictions from various decision trees, enhancing its robustness and reducing the risk of overfitting. This ensemble approach allows for better generalization across datasets with varying characteristics, although it still showed some susceptibility to scanner variations. Overall, the results suggest that combining features from different radiomic software packages can improve the predictive performance of machine learning models for CAD. However, further research is needed to address the issue of cross-vendor reproducibility and to enhance the generalizability of these models across different scanner types. The results of the SVM model trained on MR radiomics and tested on the Philips dataset, presented in Figure 7 demonstrate sensitivity to scanner variations, similar to the SVM model. In contrast, the random forest model exhibits superior performance on the Philips set with pyradiomics features, achieving an AUC of 0.78. This can be attributed to its ability to identify and prioritize the most predictive features, offering insights into the specific characteristics that are most relevant for distinguishing between classes. The SVM model, despite its high performance in certain scenarios, lacks transparency, as the decision boundaries created by SVMs are often difficult to interpret, especially when complex kernel functions are employed. This lack of explainability can be a drawback when understanding the model's decision-making process is crucial. This study critically examines the impact of radiomic feature sets, including pyradiomics, MR radiomics, and their combination, on the model's performance and reproducibility in clinical decision support for cancer detection. The integration of features from both pyradiomics and MR radiomics demonstrates competitive AUC scores on the multi-improd set, but highlights significant variability when tested across different scanners, particularly on the Philips test set. The analysis of models trained solely on pyradiomics or MR radiomics features reveals distinct patterns in predictive performance with pyradiomics-derived features consistently showing higher predictive power and robustness, as evidenced by higher AUC scores on the Philips test set. This suggests that pyradiomics features might capture more reproducible and clinically relevant information, which is crucial for the generalizability of CD systems.
The explainability of the results is anchored in the reproducibility of these feature sets. Pyradiomics features, in particular, offer a more stable basis for CDs in cancer detection, enhancing the reliability and accuracy of clinical decisions across different imaging conditions. The observed differences in model performance between the multi improd and Philips test sets can be attributed to scanner-induced variability in the reproducibility of radiomic features, emphasizing the necessity for rigorous validation of radiomic features across diverse imaging platforms. The study investigates the critical factors affecting the cross-vendor reproducibility of radio mics based machine learning models for computer-aided diagnosis of prostate cancer. The multi improd dataset comprising 180 cases captured using a Siemens machine, provides a robust and diverse sample set for testing. In contrast, the Philips test set contains only 23 cases, limiting the variability and generalizability of the models. This discrepancy in sample size contributes to the higher variance and lower AUC scores observed in the Philips test set, highlighting the challenges of training machine learning models on smaller datasets. The difference in imaging technology between Siemens and Philips scanners introduces variations in image resolution, contrast, and other technical parameters, affecting the radiomic features extracted and the model's predictive performance. The study optimizes model performance by exploring a broad spectrum of hyperparameters for random forest and SVM algorithms, prioritizing ROCAUC metrics through randomized search CV and grid search CV. The findings demonstrate the potential of combining features from both pyradiomics and MR cradiomics to enhance predictive performance in healthcare diagnostics, particularly in prostate cancer detection. The evaluation of the models highlights significant variability in performance across different imaging platforms, with the multi improd dataset showing higher AUC scores compared to the Philips test set. This discrepancy is attributed to differences in dataset sizes and the inherent variations in imaging technology between Siemens and Philips scanners. The results emphasize the critical need for rigorous validation of radiomic features across various imaging platforms to ensure the reliability and applicability of clinical decision support systems. The study highlights the superior predictive power of pyradiomics-derived features, demonstrating their potential as a stable and highly reproducible feature set. This research paper delves into the application of support vector machines, SVMs, in prostate cancer detection using MRI scans. SVMs are a type of machine learning model that can be used for classification tasks, such as identifying malignant or benign tissues in medical imaging. The authors cite various studies on the use of SVMs in different contexts, including land cover classification and gene expression data analysis. In the context of prostate cancer detection, the authors discuss the potential benefits of using SVMs for risk stratification. They reference studies that have demonstrated the effectiveness of SVMs in improving diagnostic accuracy and reducing false positives. For instance, one study showed that an SVM BASED model outperformed traditional biopsy methods in detecting clinically significant prostate cancer. The paper also discusses the importance of feature selection in SVM models. Feature selection is crucial as it helps to identify the most relevant MRI features that contribute to accurate classification. The authors mention several techniques for feature selection including sparse kernel-based ensemble learning and minimum redundancy maximum relevance feature selection. Moreover, the authors highlight the role of cost-effectiveness analysis in evaluating the use of MRI scans for prostate cancer screening. A study mentioned in the paper found that using MRI scans with SVM models could be cost-effective compared to standard biopsy methods, especially when considering the reduction in unnecessary biopsies and improved patient outcomes. Finally, the paper touches upon the limitations and future directions of this research. It emphasizes the need for larger datasets and further validation studies to ensure the reliability and generalizability of SVM models in prostate cancer detection. Additionally, the authors suggest exploring other machine learning techniques, such as deep learning models, to enhance the predictive power of MRI-based diagnostics. The reproducibility of radio mics based machine learning models for computer-aided detection of prostate cancer across different MRI scanners is a crucial aspect of accurate diagnostics. Standardization and validation of these models are essential to ensure reliable results. 
a systematic review of studies employing biparametric MRI with machine learning or deep learning techniques for prostate cancer detection, grading, and characterization reveals the challenges in generalizing image quantitation methods due to scanner type and protocol differences. To address these challenges, robust feature selection methods, such as those based on mutual information criteria, are necessary to improve model performance and reduce overfitting. A multi-class SVM classifier utilizing a binary decision tree can classify patients into different risk groups. Moreover, kernel-based learning from both qualitative and quantitative labels in prostate cancer diagnosis using multi-parametric MRI is explored. The study also investigates the use of machine learning models based on multi-parametric MRI and ultrasound videos for predicting prostate cancer. These models are compared to assess their efficacy in improving diagnostic accuracy. The importance of standardizing and validating radio mics based ML models for CAD in prostate cancer is emphasized, highlighting the need for further research to address limitations and challenges, including the need for larger datasets and more robust feature extraction techniques. This research paper delves into the application of machine learning techniques, specifically support vector machine ensemble classifiers, in predicting prostate cancer from transrectal ultrasound video clips. It also explores the variability and reproducibility of deep learning for medical image segmentation, emphasizing the importance of computational radiomic systems to decode radiographic phenotypes. In the context of radiomic feature extraction, the study utilizes the pyradiomics package to select features using the MRMR method on T2-weighted images of 434 prostate cancer subjects. The selected features are listed in Table 1, along with their respective descriptions, package names, and AUC performance in the validation set. These features include log sigma values for different texture analysis techniques such as GLDM, GLRLM, and GLSZM as well as wavelet transform and first-order statistical measures. The paper cites several previous studies that have contributed to the development of machine learning models for prostate cancer prediction, including the use of transrectal ultrasound video clips and radiomic features. It also highlights the importance of understanding the variability and reproducibility of deep learning models in medical image segmentation, as these factors can significantly impact the accuracy and reliability of diagnostic predictions. The study demonstrates the potential of machine learning techniques in enhancing the diagnostic capabilities of radiologists, particularly in identifying high-risk prostate cancer patients who may benefit from early intervention. By leveraging advanced computational tools and techniques, this research aims to improve patient outcomes and advance our understanding of prostate cancer diagnosis and treatment. In the context of prostate cancer diagnosis, this study conducts a comparative analysis of radiomic features extracted using two different packages, pyradiomics and MR cradiomics. From T2-weighted images of 434 prostate cancer subjects, features were selected based on the minimum redundancy maximum relevance method. The top-performing features extracted with MR cradiomics include texture analysis metrics such as dependence entropy, zone entropy, and joint entropy which demonstrated high area under the curve performances in the validation set. These features, derived from wavelet transformations and gray-level CO occurrence matrices, show potential for identifying prostate cancer. The features extracted using pyradiomics include wavelet LLLGLDM dependence entropy, wavelet LLLGLSZM zone entropy, and wavelet LLLGLCM joint entropy which also exhibit high AUC values, suggesting their relevance in prostate cancer detection. Notable features also include original shape metrics, log sigma values, and wavelet transformations, which contribute to the predictive power of the model. The AUC values in both packages range from 0.666 to 0.697, indicating a strong predictive performance of these radiomic features in identifying prostate cancer. This comparative analysis highlights the importance of selecting appropriate features for machine learning models in computer-aided detection systems. By identifying and comparing the most relevant radiomic features from various packages, this study aims to enhance the reliability and accuracy of prostate cancer diagnosis, contributing to the ongoing research on improving the reproducibility of radio mics-based machine learning models across different vendors.